Welcome back, UIM enthusiasts. It is time to complete another secret project. The gear we have obtained for TOA can be used for various high-level boss encounters. With new opportunities available to us, it is time to do some Theater of Blood. This is rather early to be going there, but it is going to be a short visit because our goal is to get some stamina potions from Theater. We need the stamina pool real bad as I've been walking these last three months. On the UIM, I gotta walk extra to different places just to get ready for any grinds. The other option of getting stamina is keeping rare torsos on you until you can spawn Dr. Jekyll random event 10 times to trade it in for stamina. Which, if you already didn't know, is awful for many reasons like the RNG involved and the time. The normal way is getting the herbal level, which would also take a very long time, and it's pretty boring. So top is by far the best way. I believe we now have decent enough setup to actually do proper full theater blood runs, so that way my teammates can get drops too, and maybe we can nab an early purple. Let's find out. We're gonna make some prayer pots because yeah, we've been using it quite a bit at TOA. Luckily, we get Ranarts there. So I've just been farming them. And the best part is, you see these snake grass? I didn't even pick it up at all. I grew these. So as you can see on the right, I have a bunch of snake grass I've saved up. I just plant them everywhere. Hopefully the DPS is going to be decent, boys. But yeah, this is our melee setup for most of Tob. It's pretty impressive. I'm not going to lie. We are sporting 155 melee strength. With pretty respectable accuracy as well. We're pretty much wearing like bandos, offensively speaking. The Macarena's though, is gonna be for things that have low defense or spec down. So like Nilo Crabs, maybe a Maiden, assuming we spec it down like Zarpus. The Zombie Axe is for things that are tanky, so Dark Beast and Verzik for sure. Also got our nice range switch for like Nilos and we have a Warp Scepter just for that mage. But we're not gonna bring the mage gear because we're gonna be mostly mailing. We gotta prep some food at the Warriors Guild. Although my ultimate Iron Man is probably sick of eating fast food potatoes with cheese all the time. Thankfully, I have a variety of delicious food to choose from in real life. Thanks to HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit service. HelloFresh has 50 plus dinner options curated by professional chefs. All their meals are centered on being tasty, healthy, and affordable, and covers a wide range of dietary lifestyles. All the food is freshly prepared and sent directly to you weekly. All you gotta do is pick your recipes and a delivery date or just pause orders without the cost for whatever reason. Personally, the convenience of making healthy and tasty meals from HelloFresh is unmatched. I've prepared some meals from HelloFresh this week. The instructions that come with the meal kits are easy to understand. This is a great time to boost your 2024 productivity with great meals. Use my link in the description and enter my code on the screen to receive 10 free meals plus free breakfast for life while subscription is active. Back to progress. This is how we're going to have to get here for now. Ferrying to this spot and then run to this boat. Take the boat, walk down here for now. I'm honestly just going to buy a teleport crystal. I don't really have the carry ability if everyone dies. I'll start with normal modes. Thanks, though. Thanks for being so caring. Yeah, let's just go with Gozu. Let's go with Gozu. And, of course, we have our star team members. Uh, some friends here and friends of friends. But uh, KC Collector, you've probably seen him in Iron Bar videos. And, of course, watch this guy. Mary J. A man still doing top. What's he doing? Even though he's done 3,000 tops, finally got his scythe. He's still back. But long story short, he still needs to get a sight back because he lost it. <laughs> we might have to do six tobs actually because I will probably need to drink some stamina during Verzik. Invent is a secret. What the hell is this invent? I have to know. Alright guys, we got the maiden. Yo, I got it. Nice. We poked it. Everything is low defense, so we should be able to just destroy this guy. There we go. It's working, though. We are absolutely doing some DPS right now, boys. We'll be that guy to freeze this guy here. Yeah, we are pretty comfortable with the tobs. You know, we've been here a good amount of times, and it definitely helps knowing what you're doing. There we go. Cleared. Oh! Oh, man, we're losing people here, boys. 
We are losing people. Holy. Alright, I barely did any damage though. Holy. Nice. Yo, I survived. Am I carrying the team or is the team carrying me? Who knows? Yeah, I can't really buy a brew right now. I'll just buy a shark. Oh, wait, I have to buy a stamina no, no matter what. I'll just chug and use blood barrage, you know? Blood burst. Alright, one stamina out of ten. Oh, nice. We cleared it. Pretty good. That's actually pretty cool. Three hits with a solid crossbow. Yeah, Nihilo was Gucci. We're only contributing a little bit. Just just a little bit. There you go. Second stam. There you go. That would be a decent survivable setup, I guess. Oh my oh my god, I got <laughs> I got 89 strength and I couldn't move. I I keep forgetting if you level up you get like absolutely uh, screwed. I still remember this pretty well, but I'm gonna play it a bit safer. There we go. Good. Ah, oh, dude, yo. No way you guys started it. No way you guys started it. Woo! God damn. Alright, I'm just gonna have to stamina. It's not worth it. That means we have to do an extra top, boys. But it's worth it. Absolutely not risking it. Now, oh, hell yeah, bro. First KC, alright. Had his fair share of challenges. But yeah, let's go. One KC. Nice. Just gotta do five more tops then. Alright, nice. We can see potential drops too, which is cool. Ooh, Vial of Blood. Nice. Oh, the herbs are so good. Hell yeah. I'm gonna profit on the prayer pots. Alright, so we'll just drop this for now because I need a. Just decant this into one dose. Well, if I bag the stamina, I have to suicide. And I guess I, I will. I guess I'll just suicide. It's fine. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to get this hit. So we are not going to bother. Nice. Nice. Good work. Oh, two down. Hey, we got a combat achievement. Oh, wait. We're almost done with the medium combat achievements, actually. Two more points. Nice. Nice. Oh my god, that was good. That bounce saved you, man. Oh. No. Well, my boy went so far. Okay, well, I got a stamina up. Alright, boys. I haven't tanked in a hot minute, but... We should be okay. Oh! No way! Wait, you froze it? What? Oh, come on. I got sniped by a spider. Unfortunate. Oh, someone got a purple. Let's go. See, this is why I wanted to wait so that we can actually do full completions. Nice. Good shit, boys. First purple. Dang. There you go, boy. <laughs> All right. Good luck. Oh, Defender. That's really nice, dude. Congrats. There you go. The Macarenas are so good for the Nilo Room, actually. Because the increased attack speed lets me go for the next kill pretty quick. Sonic Crossbow is not bad either because the uh, attack speed is really nice. Might have to do 7, boys. Oh, the Magic Tree Seed. That's actually really good. Because I can finish a Diary uh, task now. So that's pretty lit. Ooh, and the used to. I can store that. Yes! Oh my god. Not fun having to tank this with low supplies, but. And a guy dead, but we Gucci! Oh, oh my farming XP! Oh my god! This is so good! Except I can't plan all this all at the same time, so uh, we're gonna definitely try to make the most out of this, though. Oh, nice. Oh, we're gonna plant this right now, and we have space. Minimum of two more raids, boys, because if we can get 16 doses from two, then that's a wrap. Oh, nice. We can do another hit with the macaronis. Oh, that's so sick. Three hits with the macaroni. Because of the special. Oh, I think we can do it again. Oh, ho -ho, that's so cool. If it procs at least once the set effect, then I can do three hits if I time it right. 
Oh shit. Nice. Brewed up just in time to live. Let's go. We survive. <laughs> oh, nice. More cool stuff. Ooh, nice. What the hell? They all want to go for me? <laughs> all four? Sheesh. They're like, he's the leech, mate. He has to die. Do you run left? So... Finish it off. Ooh, nice. There we go. I got an extra dose just in case I mess up. And uh, mess up the stand pool thing. Alright, sweet. This is the end. That is 40 staminas. And we did six theaters. And unfortunately, we didn't see any more purples, but once again, congrats to Techno. Oh, I got some money, though. We'll take that. Hell yeah, that's going to pay for all the boat trips. I think those are kind of expensive here. There we go. That's uh, 10 staminas. I just got to clean up my inventory before we do this. All the profit that I made from top is going to go straight to the soul runes. Oh, okay. All the runes done for the first pool. Saw hammer. Here it is. The first pool, which is the restoration pool. Just in case I make a mistake, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to turn this into four doses like this. So that way I don't have to manually do it and accidentally drink it. There we go. Best part is the upgrade. There we go. Revitalize station pool. Done. Sweet. I guess we could upgrade all the way up to level 80 as well. And also 85. We can't do 90, unfortunately. Because that requires anti-venom. So that's like 80 plus. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. I totally forgot I have prayer potions already in my inventory. So I can just upgrade it to the next pool already. So that's nice. That means I don't even have to use the altar anymore. On the side, I've continued to work on some important goals to round out our character, such as quest unlocks, improving the house with more teleports, and of course, making more money with woodcutting and fletching. Enjoy. A lot of things to do still before we can move on to like the next PVM adventure. We got some quests we want to do here. I want to get Kingdom Divided done tonight, just to get myself the Book of the Dead and Thralls. Holy, this thing's pretty lit, man. Nice. Oh, it's definitely a lot of fun using this set, man. I, I just see a lot of random extra damage and whatnot. What is this guy weak to, man? Oh, I'm going to use the spec. Let's go. Oh, there you go. Now I can attack faster. That's what the spec does. Uses up some HP, but I get to attack faster for a few hits. We didn't bring enough food for this fight, and we got to prepare better. Like, zombie axe would have definitely been a lot better for this. Or range, of course, but I didn't have time to prep a range, but... Yeah, really good on low defense, but definitely loses a lot of power on high defense. There you go. Well, at least I know the mechanic. What? 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 Why did it... Oh, I got bound in place? Even if you drop the stuff on the ground... Moon stuff is the same as barrels. It, st it stays the same. Oh my god, look at that. Zombie Hex is definitely so much better. Ah, you can Wooks walk it like at Vorkath. Huh. All right, yeah, you actually can't really defeat him. I'm so ready to fight the real version of this boss whenever that happens in the future. Surely there's like a sequel to this. Yo, Kingdom Divided done. That was actually decently challenging, but... Yeah, we got thralls unlocked, so definitely looking forward to doing something with that in the future. Surely lots of uses. I'm gonna put the XP lamps onto Herbler. Oh, we got two of these. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. 63 Herbler. Oh, super stores. That's actually huge. Nice. Nice. What we got? Ooh. Bronze Kite Shield G. Nice. I ended up getting a elemental talisman. While working on some clues and yeah, might as well finish some diary stuff. We need that cheeky magic imbue just to make this lava rune. So we got binding necklace as well from the leeches. So this should work. 
There we go. Nice. All right, there we go. Bye bye, elemental talisman. We're gonna be doing making friends with my arms, just cause I would like to unlock those herb patches. Also unlock the teleports in my nexus. We need to get six fire making levels. There we go. We got the clue hunter outfit. This is a nice storable set that we can use for winter Todd. Heck yeah, getting some free combat achievements too while we're doing this. A first fire making level, five more to go. The rates are pretty insane. 62 fire making, let's go. All right, this rate is gonna take us about an hour to finish this grind, so. Oh, I got it, come on, come on. Nice, there you go, repair task done. Might as well get some free points while training here. Yes, there we go, I got it. Yay, I healed my pyromancer. Another task done. Oh, what the hell? I got a Bruma Torch? Hey, Winnetaw Champion, sweet. Nice. Oh, what? I actually completed leaving no one behind. That is so lucky. <laughs> I've heard that it's possible. Uh, that one's where all four Parmisters never went down. There we go. Yay, I can now light troll fires. And you can't boost for this. But yes, we have gone everything we need and some CAs out of this. So that's pretty cool. And this Cold War requires so much random shit. Thankfully, we have all the teleports pretty much nowadays. Nice. Cold War completed. Yes, one of the boss fights for the quest requires or is highly recommended with range. So definitely want to take this bad boy out for a spin. We already have some bolts from earlier, so. Oh, that's so annoying. There you go, got him. This is gonna take a while. Ah, oh, God, that's so annoying. We got it, yes. Yep, Sunlight Crossbow did the job. Hell yeah, pretty big quest done. The Seas Free Herb Patch, Salt Technology. The Salt Technology is huge. Oh, 70 Jody? no way, I didn't have to train. Oh my god, that's actually so huge. Sonia Jody, dude. Nice. That's Sarah Godward's dungeon, Tavley dungeon, Fossil Island, Harvest Shortcut, and Bows of Fernand. Oh, that's a requirement as well. Yeah. Sonia Jody for something else as well. All right. With our Atoll money, it's time to upgrade our Nexus, guys, because we're going to build all the new Wise uh, and Trollheim tellies. It's going to cost us about 1.6 mil. Tier 2 Nexus. And that opens up quite a lot because I think Tier 2 Nexus is 8 teleports, and that's pretty much what we need. So, yeah, we're going to add two more tellies to this the Wise and the Charm. So, we're going to work on that now. All right. We're going to be doing this for a long while, I guess. We're going to need 2,000 of these. Thankfully, I can note them upstairs so it's doable on the Ultimate Iron Man. Uh, we need 2,000 of the red salts. We need 3,000 of the blue. And 3,000 of the green. I think we're done. 2,000 basalt. Oof. Took a, quite a while, man. Now we gotta mine the rest. Luckily, we don't have to move around and note stuff. This is already noted form. Alright, guys. Finished 3,000. Blue is done. Hey, we're done. All right, so we have a lot of options here, but these are the two that we mainly want. There we go. Oh, this is so beautiful. Because then, check this out, right? I can go pretty close to the art patch right here. We're not done yet. There's still some things I got to use the salt for, and that is to make these eternal fire pits in certain places. For example, this one, Fire of Nourishment, I believe that one's for the wise patch, meaning uh, the herbs will never die. Bro, that's the craziest shit I've seen in a bit. This man's like, Spirit one, and then shows KC. Less than 30 seconds later, a boom, Zami Spear. All right, boys, we're going to make the most important one. Any seeds that we get, especially from TOA, like Snapdragons, Ranars, oof, definitely going there. There is the second most important one done. And yeah, no longer do we get trolled by the ice. Here we are at the final pit stop. <laughs> Anyways, yes, this is the last one. 
We're gonna install a few more tellies, Lumbridge and Watchtower, because goddamn, beyond ancients, getting to these places is really hard. Yeah, see, this is why we built all these portals, man, because I knew TOA was gonna give me the dankest of herbs, boys. Like, all right, just one of these rays can give you all these, like, precious snaps. We're gonna plant it only on the ones that can't die, right? A 77 farming. Getting close to be able to plant all these other seeds, man. I didn't want to get rid of them. Hell yeah. 89 we're cutting, boys. Oh, 1725 total. Nice. Almost can access another tier of total worlds. 25 more levels. I got 79 fletching, though. One more level I can make my short bow. This shop is really good for oranges, for maples. So if you do your perilous moon run, yeah, stock up on here. This guy is the guy to go to. Oh, shoot. 90 woodcutting, guys. You might be asking, am I just going to go for 99 woodcutting or something right away? Not really. Uh, I think I might do some other kind of AFK for a while because I'm almost to 80 fletching, which I think is a good stopping point. I really don't need money right now, I feel like. And uh, 80 fletching, like I said, is the magic short bow. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the big level. Possibly the last fletching level for a bit. We'll see. I'm not 100% sure yet, but we can make magic short bows at will now. So I guess starting tomorrow night, I'm going to just make one and just start AFK ranging, man. Got to get it up, man. It's the only non uh, 80 plus skill for combat right now. So we got to work on that. So. Oh, yeah, that's right. I planted one of these. Uh, I don't even know where I got it from. Oh, probably just from woodcutting, right? Yeah, that's another random diary done. Ooh, okay. Some collection log stuff. Naratelli's. Five. Oh, Zambi page. Yes. Wait. Oh, this is a freaking dupe, bro. Are you serious? There it is. 85 mining. I am so excited for this. Because I can mine some runite in Volcanic Mine as well. Wait, this gives you a brown apron too? Oh, needle and glass blowing pipe. What the hell? I never even used this one. Oh, another boater. Jesus. I'm going to get all the boaters. And lastly, what? Double headband. That's hilarious, mate. And a U compo. Oh, I can put that in my house. That, that might be useful. Oh, yeah. The headband is good. I know that's a clue, clue item, so that's cool. Nice. We just hit 75 prayer. That's pretty good. 